when they walked in, I was like, wow, okay. There was, I had these two people, and I'm like, what do I do with this? There's this woman who, you know, her joints, her knees, her elbows were really swollen. She said she couldn't use them. And then I have this guy, two men actually, that were very fit, but I think high. And when I moved from New York City to Venice, and I made some calls to the shelters in and around the west side, and everyone was just really excited and would love to have a yoga program. So I got volunteer yoga instructors, and they come into the shelters um, one hour a week, and they teach a class. I just feel so ready to give more because I feel like I've received so much, and it's just that cycle, and it really will, I hope it never ends. New instructors, there's a thing that they do usually when they're when they're just beginning to teach, it's called SEVA and it's like giving back. And in the last six years we've had I guess over 20 weekly classes started and over 200 clients and people seem to really love it. Lungs up with air and X. Just being paid attention to for that hour and providing them the time just to, to really kind of go inside and be calm and be still and not be stressed out about you know, where they're gonna get their next meal or where they're gonna sleep that night. I really personally saw, you know, the, the transformation it had with them. It's just been so incredible working with this fun group of guys. They're like funny, they make me laugh so hard. Like we will start meditating, we'll start breathing. It's just sweet, it's, it's human connection, but it's also teaching them their own human connection. And down. Uh, I came into this thing with uh, anger issues and I've been treated with uh, therapy. This gives me real physical help in order to maintain that tranquility. You know, when there's 48,000 people experiencing homelessness and there's not 48,000 shelter beds, I can understand our clients losing hope. So PATH is one of the largest homeless service providers in the state of California, and our mission is to end homelessness for families, individuals, and communities throughout the state of California. When I became the volunteer coordinator here, Alma Yoga was really one of the first projects that I wanted to expand. I got a sense of these people who don't really have homes, like, you know, they have temporary housing and how, what a great service would be to teach them tools that they could actually do themselves to find sort of the home within their own selves, no matter where they're living at the moment. And exhale, twist. I had gotten hit by a car. When I first started off, I was walking like Frankenstein, you know, the monster. A couple months, I was walking normal. More than anything, these people need someone to care about them and to be inspired. And with that strength behind them, they are able to make moves. If you like what you saw, please click the subscribe button and leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.